How have you guys been seeing the ebook versus hardcover? How have those been selling when compared to each other? Like what's doing better? So I think the hard copy is still doing better. Yeah. Because there's so many graphics, there's a challenge with ebook finding it. Sure. So it doesn't have all the capabilities uh, of an ebook. Like you can't, it's hard to change the font. Um, the translation function doesn't work. It's actually really hard to translate skincare terms. Yes. <laughs> like through languages, what we're learning is like, it's very, or I guess relations like very foreign. So there is no translation available for the ebook version, but a lot of our, you know, followers, they're international. So having the ebook is really nice for them since the hardcover is only sold in the States. Is that because other languages just, they don't have the terms or it's too scientific to, I don't even know what like the process would be. We should use Chinese as an example. <laughs> yeah, I think they do have all the terms, but it just doesn't link up very well. And we try to be funny in the book <laughs> and jokes are really hard to translate to other languages. <laughs> yes, I only speak one language, but I understand that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I speak Chinese fluently. So even if you were to tell me to translate one of the passages with a joke into Chinese, I, I wouldn't know how to do it. I did say, I did write in our contract, I did mention that if there were to be a Chinese version, then I will have to review it. Like if it's too cringy, I'm gonna- You've have gotta to add in all your jokes now. again. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be funny, but th it is currently being translated to German as far as we know. So I think one of the chapters cleansers I was struggling so hard trying to think of like an analogy of like what this cleanser was. I have actually never gotten to talk to Gloria about this, but basically um, the analogy was that the cleanser is like your Scotty Pippin in that doesn't get all the fame, but is so crucial to your routine. And I think about this wow. a lot because I didn't Are you know. an avid basketball fan? Well, I'm not, I wouldn't say I'm like, I'm like religious, but I mean, yeah, I grew up in that era. Like, I do appreciate basketball. I watch, sure. I really hate where the Rockets are right now. <laughs> um, but, uh, not a good I spot. have to hear about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so like, it's, it's moments like that where I'm like, how does this get translated? But I don't know how else to like make that connection, you know, and try to like, just help like bridge the gap.